We've got here a question on, uh, again, the power principles. Discover yourself and keep reinventing the real you. Talk to me about discovering yourself. How do people go about that? Why is that beneficial? It, it, it's, it's rigorous and it is, it's highly important. I, my, when I look back through my profession, through my experience, through my education, and I find those people that are out there doing what they need to do and have the ability to influence, all of them without fail, went through a process of self-discovery. Who am I? What am I all about? There's a, there's a lot of tools out there that can help you, Charlie, get to where you want, want to be. Uh, I, I have a simple mechanism that will take you there. But what we're looking for is it's conditioning, psychological preference, what it is that I am naturally wired to do. Okay. Uh, what are my strengths? If, if I can encourage you or another to play to their strengths, obviously the equation says they're not going to fail. If I can encourage you to recognize and become aware of weaknesses or opportunities to improve, however you might want to, you might want to classify that. But it's, it's you need to take a, a. I would suggest to those out there that are the watches, you know, take a systematic approach, get some help with it. The payoff is tenfold. But who are we? What are our strengths? What are our weaknesses? What do we value? What's important to us? And uh, how do we put that into together? It's like, it's like my, uh, one of my, my favorites is we seek to understand another the same way we seek to understand ourselves, and that's got to come first. Yeah.